Ladies and gentlemen, it is your man Bill here. Um, as you know, there is some pretty crazy stuff going down in the community. Uh, as obviously some of you know, uh, Arnold did get an account banned. Uh, it was very controversial. And I just kind of wanted to offer up a take on that real quick um, and just kind of give you a different perspective uh, and just coming at it from someone who's getting new into this community. Uh, full disclosure, uh, I have spent a considerable amount of money to get to the point where I can even just do this, which is hopefully attempt to create my first video. Now, I would be remiss if I did not mention uh, the four pillars of this community that pushed me into this without even knowing that. And I think we all know who they are. That's Arnold, uh, Cups Fan Han, Mobile Gamer, and um, you're also going to have the amazing Urs. Uh, now, all four of these guys are very different, uh, but they all create amazing content. If you haven't followed them already, please do. Uh, honestly, the things that they do for this game are what pushed me to do this. It was in no way capital games. I mean, I do love this game, and I wanted to play this game and play it with others in my community and bring the joy that I feel from playing this game with my community members uh, to other people as well, too. I feel like that's an invaluable thing to give to people. Now, the unfortunate thing is, is no matter how hard we try and no matter how good of a product we are bringing uh, to the table, they're just going to still keep taking from us, seemingly. Um, and I mean that in a way that's pretty uh, noticeable now. I mean, they're not giving us any sort of information that we need on time. Uh, Galactic Legends was a total, total garbage event. Um, just me personally, I spent a considerable amount of money recently to try to get... Uh, general anakin skywalker in the gas event and i was not able to and i'm pretty convinced that that's almost solely based on rng and my bad plays too we'll say however there is an overall bad taste i think in people's mouths concerning cg uh and their interaction with this community and really what i wanted to focus on for this video is is just pointing out to the average viewer um truly how prolific capital games abuse and misuse of power has been and really the one thing that i wanted to highlight here is this specific part of arnold's video that i'm just gonna bring up right here um which is where arnold talks about another reaction with the community now we don't know if this is true but i have seen and heard Similar reactions to this. Um, and now, if you read this, uh, this is going to be uh, interesting to say, but basically what, what it says is, is that this person got caught cheating, basically. Um, they got caught red-handed, and they got thereby given a reduced punishment because of their previous service to the community. Now, this is literally, I don't know if you remember uh, the case that this applied to. This is the case of affluenza, almost. Like, that this person didn't have contact with, you know, what was actually going on in the community at that point and was so far from it that he didn't really com commit anything wrong, A. B, he's also getting preferential treatment, Based on being involved in the beta, but I'm assuming it's not just that. I'm assuming based on the money spent. Um, and you can really say see that right here uh, because they allow them to decide when they're going to go to jail. I mean, the only times that we see this in our society is when affluence has something to play with it. And money is making the decisions, but in a very, very, very negative way. And this is what we see right here. We're watching a content creator um and he did make a mis mistake and you can argue that he did break the rules um however his argument also holds water there are a lot of people breaking the rules right now this is the only clear pathway for as a new incoming player to develop an account that's actually playable in 
the current late game stages. It, it, everybody knows this. It's so true. It's on Discord. So if you're going to go ban Arnold, where are you're not going to ban Discord from being able to use your servers? I mean, they're proliferating this as well. You're not going to ban the posters on there. Uh, you're not going to ban the countless other people that are using uh, accounts from players that you made leave the game. Let's just let's just let's go to that as well too. You made these you drove these people away in my opinion with your shitty tactics. That's the truth. I mean, that is the absolute truth. I mean, it's it's, it's terrible to say um but that's what's up. I mean, we're in a point in time now where uh, people can get away with it, and they're obviously getting away with it right here. Uh, and the funniest part about this, to me at least, when I look at all this is, is nobody wins in this, you know? So I'm going through right now, and I'm looking at just their p terms of service, you know, when it comes to uh, who they kick out and who they get in trouble on their, on, uh, their cheating uh, uh, forums, you know? And uh, at least on their cheating guidelines. And look at this. I mean, if we're looking at this right now, there's nothing on here that says um, we're going to give you preferential treatment based on whether or not you're in the beta. None of this is stated to us. So maybe they do have these rules. But yet again, CG is lacking communication. You know, I mean, everything in this, you can come at me with any argument you want. Everything in this points back to CG starting it out which is just a terrible situation for us to be in with them at the helm. I mean, even them themselves are saying that you will be permanently banned or a temporary ban will be issued. It's not under the time frame when you decide that to be. That's not justice. That's what we're talking about here, folks. What is just? And that is not justice. These people are being allowed to proliferate their accounts in game that are cheating and then cg is coming in and, and and hammering out a deal with them i mean this should be a permanent ban it should be an immediate ban for when this for when this sort of shit happens and it should be across the board you shouldn't be allowed to pick and choose who you're doing and i think that is the largest thing that uh Arnold is bringing to the table here. He is saying that it is it's not fair and we've seen it it's not fair. Um he's saying that it's not just and we definitely have proof that it isn't. And if here's my thing, if it starts here with the person that makes them arguably the largest amount of money without them putting any amount of income into him or any amount of investment into him, right? They just let him go and he makes some money hand over fist because we wail on characters after we see what he's doing, right? So he's making money hand over fist and they're doing, they're rolling this way to him. Um, man, that, I, it, it scares me. As a new up and coming content creator in this um, arena, I don't feel comfortable making Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes content. Are they going to remove it? Um, what are they going to do overall that's going to keep me from growing my channel? We've seen that as well. Uh, Mobile Gamer commented on that. Um, are, if I do make it to the top, will they crumble my house that I have built around me? Uh, that's what they're trying to do to Arnold right now. You know, So as someone that's spent thousands of dollars being able to create content, hopefully, and good content to bring to people, it's one of the scariest things that I could imagine. You know, here are people stepping in and literally just putting the hammer down on an in, an intense income stream for them without really thinking ahead. Like, they literally DGAF, you know. They do not care. Um, and that's frightening. You know, so, folks, if you feel differently, I don't know. That's cool. That's on you. That's why we live in this beautiful uh world that we live in is to have social discourse with each other in a positive way uh, unfortunately the companies that we're paying uh, aren't able to do this uh, and we're having to step up to do this uh, so if you can get on over to mobile gamer or any of the other uh, people's channel drop them uh, a like in the comments if you haven't already dropped a like on this video uh, please feel free to uh, i'd really appreciate that and uh, please feel free to drop a subscribe too i know this is the first video but we'll see how it goes 
anyways guys uh we'll see you over on twitch and keep it real thanks so much everybody and uh try to keep your head up out there